Ipsar is a biodiversity center at the American University of Beirut. It includes faculty, students, and staff from various disciplines who work together with the common objective of conserving and sustainably using biodiversity. In 2011, Ipsar launched the Biodiversity Village Award. This project was conceived to promote decentralization of biodiversity conservation by engaging village communities in the process of planning for the conservation of their village's natural resources. Eighteen villages participated in the Biodiversity Village Award project 2011. Each village formed a local committee that consisted of representatives from local authorities, schools, civil society and private institutions. This documentary was produced to inspire other Lebanese villages by disseminating one environmental best practice identified in each village. The village of Kessin is promoting the sustainable use of its ancient and diversity-rich pine forest by encouraging villagers to collect non-wood forest products such as wild plants, pine seeds, honey and others and sell them as traditional produce to tourists. هيدا الهون المحل رح يستقبل الناس اللي جايين تيستفيدوا من التنزه بالغابة في أربعين ألف متر تخذ فيهم قرار مجلس البلدي الاجتماع الماضي تحت دفتر شروط حطته البلدية تيحافظ على البيئة The municipality of Deir Zahrani initiated a program that caters for people with special needs. So far, the team has planted more than 1,500 carob and walnut trees, in addition to organizing regular street cleaning activities. We have a program that is more than 3,000 shajras in the year, in the year of the year, of course, and also a lot of important things. Lebanon's mountain tops are considered the water reservoirs of the country. The people of Mrusti have decided to focus their tree planting activities in the degraded highlands of their village, located at an altitude of 1,800 meters. <laughs> السنة الثانية زرعنا بحدود الميت أرزة السنة الثالثة نوعنا سنديان ومن ملول ومن أرز
families in Bibnin rely on traditional fishing as their main source of income. The practices include manual weaving of fishing nets by women and boat construction by men. For the past few years, the village of Ras al Matan prepared several studies with the objective of conserving and sustainably using the village's pine. These efforts have succeeded in securing funding for the construction of an information center named the Forest House at the entrance of the forest. هذا المشروع أخذ كانت مدة سنة لكن التحضير له يمكن أخذ أكثر من 12 سنة يمكن من وقت اللي بلشنا بالخرائط بالمشروع أساسي التنفيذي لما نلاقوا الدراسات مجدية تأمن التمويل من قبل الاتحاد الأوروبي The people of Chennai decided to turn their village's landfill area into a public garden, which they are currently planting with various forest trees, mainly cedar trees. The village of Niha is promoting mountain biking as an outdoor sport in the woodlands of the village, where mountain paths and old village roads are being rehabilitated. The youth in Ain Zibdi are actively involved in nature conservation in their village. They consistently make it a point to involve their young siblings in green village activities in order to keep environmental responsibility as a priority issue in future generations. نشجروا وفي كثير غير نشاطات، هم كانوا يشتغلوا كنا نتفرج عليهم، بعدين صاروا يعلمونا 
شوي شوي انه كيف الحفرة بنحط الشجرة بنحط عليها مي وبعدين بنثبتها بالحجار ممكن ندق عليها عمود كرمال ما تلق الشجرة وهيك The people and municipality of Ait al Fukhar took the initiative to protect wild partridges and rabbits in their highlands. The village community supports forest guards to ensure compliance to this decision and to observe national hunting laws. In addition, the municipality has put up signs prohibiting the hunting of partridges and rabbits. أنا مين على العالم كله تطلع على الحراش من شين الصيد ومن شين أصل الحطب ومن شين تعد على الحراش أملاك العالم أملاك الدولة كلها بطلع ببرم جبيل كل يعني خمسين كل متر بيمشي بجبيل بالويدين لا أرجع البيت. The municipality of Dahr al Ahmar is working closely with government authorities to designate a public land as protected area. The municipality hopes that once protected, these lands will attract native and migrating birds as well as various wild animals. We have been working on the Wizard of the Bia to increase this area to be protected in the area of the area. طبعا بالتواصل مع وزارة المالية بين وزارة البيئة ووزارة المالية تم السماح للبلدية باستعمال هالعقار صباح الخير وصلتوا على مدخل محمية أرز الشوف غابة أرز الباروك عندكم 60 كيلو متر رح نطلع من هون بالسيارة بقلب الغابة رح نمشي بين أرز عمره 50 سنة لنصل للأرز القديم المعمر لعمره ألاف السنين بس نصل لفوق أكيد بيكون معكم جايد عم يشرح لكم بينزلكم وبيعملكم جولة بين أقدم شجر أرز بالغابة لون الخضار اللي بيعطيها ورقة الشغلة الثالثة والأهم جميع أشجار العالم ثمرت طبعوا لنزول باستثناء شجرة الأرز ثمرتها بتشمخ طلوح The community in Baruk village actively participates in the maintenance and management of the Shuf Cedars Nature Reserve. The reserve is rich in ancient cedar. The community is using the visitor's information center to sell their traditional foods. The village of Arayhan is working on a project that seeks to transform their beautiful natural cave into a touristic attraction.
In the 1960s, the youth of Hamana used to plant cedar trees in the village's highlands. This activity stopped in the late 1970s and was resumed in the late 1990s. ابتداء من سنة 98 رجع بلش النشاط البيئي بحمانة بسنة 2004 و 2005 صار في تركيز على هذا الموضوع بلش التنزرع بالمرج وبالجبل شربين أرز سنديان There is a consensus among families in Mishmish that the village forests should be protected. The villages interplant these forests with rain-fed grains and cereals and collect wild edible plants. بالصيفية بطلع لهان وبالشتوية بنزل على مشمش بشتى مشمش وبعيد الحرشات وبالبالشتوية مر عليه مرات مرات بطلع عليه هون من حدا يقصون أو حدا يقرب عليه هون وبالصيفية ببعيد لهان إيه وما في نترك الحرشات قاعدين أنا والمرة والولاد نوتير للحرشات وبس وبنفلح شوية حمص حد منها هان وشوية أمح وبس ما في عالم حد منا هني بالمرة منجيب أكل معنا منجيب منت الصيفي كله لهون. Through trial and error, the people of Arsil have successfully found a way to benefit from semi-arid highlands surrounding their village by planting more than a million cherry trees, and the cherry harvest season has become an occasion for all generations to come together. <laughs> The municipality of Minyara has transformed what used to be the largest garbage dump in the Akka region into a public garden that is now the pride of the village, where the children meet and annually participate in tree planting. The village of Jizin is rehabilitating and reviving old stairs and mountain footpaths that were used to connect with nearby villages. With this effort, Jizin hopes to promote outdoor walking and trekking in the village highlands. In the village of Kaukaba, one can find very old olive trees that are said to have been planted during the Roman Empire before the birth of Christ. The villagers have a special relation with these trees and are planning to protect them from being uprooted and planted as ornamental trees. <laughs> Thank you.
كثير تغربت وعشت برا وكانوا كثير بيعنوا لي وهن شدوني لارجع على كوكبها، كثير اجينا عروضات لنبيعهم لا يعملوا فيهم اشياء نحن مرضينا وكثير من الطوارئ عملوا صوره غلاف مجلاتهم حتى بالنروج تكون زيتونه من هالزيتونات هودي. Following the formation of village committees, Ipsar used icons developed by Google Green Map and the participatory mapping approach to help participating committees identify and place their natural resources and social landmarks on one map. Mm -hmm. 